today we're going to be unlocking and fully upgrading the ghoul race. So step one is we actually need to get into the cursed ship and collect 100 ectoplasm, Ow. which you're not supposed to be able to do until you're level 1000. But guess what? We're going to cheat. Wait, how do we cheat? Are we breaking it? The way that we can break into the cursed ship or... Sorry. Breaking in? I love breaking and entering. Well, the way we can break the law and get into the curse ship early is we got to grab a boat. And if you see way out there, you can kind of see it phasing in out of existence. That oh, is, is that the curse ship. Zone? Yeah, if we go all the way out there, we can reset character and break into the curse ship. <laughs> what the hell? There, the squad. Oh, oh, I see it. I see it. I see it. There. Converge on I me. Like it's guys. there in the distance. Oh, okay. And as soon as... Okay, now we are officially in the cursed ship. If I reset character right here... Wait, where? I'm not seeing just, it. Just go Wait. under. Go under until you see cursed ship at the top of your screen. Okay, I'm in the cursed ship early. Okay, so once we're in here, we need to just kill enemies until we can collect 100 ectoplasm. That will be step one. And then the hard part. <laughs> That's not the hard part? No. Oh! Okay, are you in? Are you in? Oh! Look! <laughs> okay. Oh, no. No, I went through the door. I wanted to see my... Are you serious? I'm so sorry. I went through the door. I wanted to see if I could. Real? I got to go all the way back. No! Okay, I'm all the way back, finally. <laughs> yeah, I already have five ectoplasm. You guys are doing I nothing right now. Do I have to, like, get a quest? No. No, it's, it's literally you just get some randomly every time you kill an enemy. Be better. Not Be better. Oh, my God. I still haven't gotten one. Maybe the humans over here don't give it. Maybe I got to go find someone more ghoulish. Go kill Michael. <laughs> oh, I got an ectoplasm. Oh, my God. She did it. I got slime. Do people still use slime? People still buy that? Who a real slime fan out here? I actually have purchased a lot of slime. Okay. Too much, Too much slime that my mom made me throw it out. So, um. We had to throw it out because Kelly ate the slime. <laughs> I, I hit 100. That new title unlocked. The ghost. That actually was really fast. <laughs> we need to move on to step two. Okay. So for step two, we need to find the cursed captain. So we actually need to start server hopping now because the cursed captain will only spawn on a full moon. We are going to need to kill him a lot because what we are trying to get is a 1 to 2% 2 drop chance item. The hellfire torch from the cursed captain. 1 to 2%? What? So basically the strategy now is we need to just keep server hopping and looking for servers that are a full moon and not nighttime and just hoping that he has spawned in on the ship and it's gonna take Yay! us at least like i don't know maybe 12 tries 10 20 tries i don't have space for rubber crew. oh i'm sorry chris captain my server my server my server someone's in here already fighting him. Oh, okay. 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 i took you to the wrong place okay. i took you to the wrong place i don't know just find my server to join me i'm not we're all in here all my friends let's get in here <laughs> Kelly, do not join michael's server yet i need to take you there oh, so you can talk with Oh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna... No! He killed him, but I didn't get enough damage to get anything. No! Okay, okay, but that didn't take too long to find a cursed captain. So, you know what, guys? I think we got good odds here. Just keep looking. Set your own point. Set your own point. Everybody wants to be a ghoul these days. Kelly made it. Kelly, get up here. You gotta do damage as fast as you can. You gotta do enough that you still get credit. See, this guy's messing him up. Kelly, get up here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's about to be dead, Kelly. Oh, my God. Oh, I got credit, but I didn't get the torch. No torch. What about you? No. Oh, Kelly, your mic, your mic, your mic, your mic, your mic. Your mic, your mic. Oh, we sorry. almost got him. We've got him on the ropes. All right, and then I stun him. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, oh. No, Please. no, where'd he go? Where'd no. he go? Please, where did he go? Oh, no, I got the red, I got the red spiky coat. Oh, that's not God, him. Bro. That's not the torch, oh, but it's the coat I can wear. God, that I think bro. that'll do oh, pretty good. I got the blue got spiky the, coat, but it's not I got the, the thing. Rest. What the? We got every spiky coat, but no torch. I've never felt so angry. I don't want this guy to get the last hit. I didn't get it. He got the torch. I'm gonna. Oh, he really are got you that. Are you serious? He's holding Wait, the can torch. Can he do it for us? Are can you he do it for us? No, he can't do it for us. Help me! Help me! <laughs> Help me. <laughs> no, right, no, Alan. Man, I can't get him. Help me. <laughs> you get the thing? Oh my God! Sound like I got the thing. You already know I'm obsessed with it. Get him, get him, get him! No, he's not! Do not let them despawn! Get him, grab his legs! You are not leaving, you are not running! Hey, yo, fight back! Fight back! No! Oh, you gotta be joking. No, 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 no! He was Please. literally up! I don't even know, I literally don't think no. anything that's ever happened in my life. Oh, you knocked him out of my, my old! Oh. Anyway, did you get it? Did you get it, Jack? I got 10 ectoplasms. <gasps> I 
it's so tough. I thought the thing you were holding was it. I think it might be you can't get in unless you're high enough level. That is what I was going to say. Well, because if I'm not getting ectoplasm and you are from killing him, what other... Okay. Oh, what combo can come? If this is it, I'll cry. If this is it, I'll cry. I just want to stay for the record. I'll cry on camera. Oh, Anybody? oh, oh, baby. Ah! Ah! Oh, baby. Ah! Ah! Oh my god, I think you have to be level 1,000. Okay, guys, so basically, Jack is level 1,000. He leveled up while we were doing this, and he is the only one who has managed to get a torch. I have not gotten a torch. I think you have to be level 1,000. Okay, Jack, go turn in your torch, and then we're gonna have to level up to 1,000, and then we'll have to come back and do this more after Ooh! I'm 1,000. Go, right, down, here, down, here, down, here, down here, down here, down here, down here, Jack. This way, this way, this way, this way. Okay, escort me. I don't want to die. If I lose this, I will actually... You know what? I can't say this on camera, so never mind. <laughs> Whoa! Get away from him! Get away from him! The chef! Oh! Protect I mean, me! Help, help me! me. Help. You know I already, help. you already know. I can't get enough. Help me! Jack, are you I'm a ghoul? ghoul? baby, look at me, I got ghoul. Oh, be the ghoul, baby! Yeah. I'm a ghoul. Okay, I am at least 150% certain that you have to be a minimum high enough to enter the place. You're telling me that we've been working on this video for three days and we need to be level 1,000. I got that call! No, I'm the last I one! No! Oh my god. Look, it's so tiny in my hand. Come on, brother. I'm the runner. Oh, yeah. no. Ah. Please, it's just me. It's just me. Oh, Michael's oh. a rotten egg. All right, guys. I'm just on Jack's account now. We both have ghoul, Kelly. You and me. And step two now is we need to get V2 ghoul, okay? So just to catch you up on what V1 ghoul is going to get us, we're going to have slightly increased regen speed and 30% extra run speed at night. How ghoulish. Oh. How ghoulish. Extra ghoulish. So that's our goal right now is to show you guys how to get V2. And I, oh. where, where is the V2, man? Where, oh, oh, over here, guy. Over here, over here, over here, over here. So to get V2, we got to come over here to the alchemist Nerd. on the green zone island. Okay, so we come to the alchemist and he's going to tell us we have not unlocked our maximum potential yet. If you're seeking more power, I need you to bring me three flowers spread across the entire map. Come back when you find yeah. them. Okay, so the three oh. flowers we need uh. are the yellow flower, the red flower, and the blue flower, okay? Whoa. Bring them flowers, I barely know them. So first of all, to get the yellow flower, you need to just kill enemies. It's literally just a really small drop chance when you kill any enemy. So just go crazy. Go crazy, bam, man. Bam. Oh, oh, okay, I got flower three. Okay, so this is the yellow flower, and oh, I you, I literally got that. I just had to kill five. Oh, you got it too? I okay. Now, the next two flowers, the, really just one? He's so yeah. lucky. The next two flowers are the red flower and the blue flower. And the red flower only spawns during the day, and the blue flower only spawns during the night, okay? So I'm going to show you this. Why is it so hard? Nothing worth doing is easy. One of the spawn points for the red flower is here. It's not here, so this is not where it spawns. The other spawn point is right around over here near uh, Fajita, but I don't I see it. Did not spawn here either. Our next spawns, are, our next two spawns, or actually three spawns are here near the cafe. All right, the first spawn point here uh, for the red flower is over on top of this plateau over here. Like it'll spawn right in the center yeah. of this thing here, not here. Okay. Next spawn is okay. gonna be up in the mansion. Okay, so the the red flower will spawn literally right up here in this flower bed. Okay, Turn not here. here. I think there's one spot left. It's actually about to be night, so it'll despawn if it turns night. Quick, yeah, quick, 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 quick. Go, 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 go. Ah! Uh, okay, the next one is somewhere around in between one of these pillars, but it's either the left or the right side, and I forgot which one. Uh, not on this side. Let's try the other side. <laughs> Over here, this way, this way. I think it can spawn, like, literally right in here. Oh, yeah. Oh, can I fly? Ready, 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 ready. You see it, you see it. Oh, look, look, look. Oh, it's so tiny. We almost missed it. Wait, you picked it up, and I didn't get it. What the heck? <laughs> um, you see it for real? I guess I'm waiting for the next flower to spawn. <laughs> Oh. oh, also, we need to not die while we have these flowers or else we're going to lose them. Just a warning. You don't worry about that? that. Don't worry about that. Run, 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 run. <laughs> the next spawns for the blue flower, which is the nighttime one, is there are five as well. The first spot it can spawn is on one of these graves, but none of them have it, so it's not here. The second spot is right down here, I believe under this tree. Not here either. And then there's a secret spot. Check this out. Follow me. We got to go out there to that rock out there. You see that? All right, so this is actually kind of a secret area, but if you come over to this rock out here and you go under under here there's a cave in you come in here and guess what this is only this is part one here okay take a look look at the roof right here oh! we got a hole in the roof come up here and okay the flower did not spawn here but it can spawn right here all right this is the last place it can spawn so if it's not here uh i don't know all right so on this island it can spawn literally just either right here in the center or right by a rock near a tree i think right here under one of these trees either this one maybe this one now here's one thing as well i do believe it will guaranteed spawn every day what even 
the red or the blue flower. So if you check every spot and you haven't seen it, you need to just go back and check again because it might just not have spawned yet. So if we go back to the graveyard right now, it might have spawned in at one of these graves. Oh, it spawned in. It's here. Oh, wait, it spawned down here. This is a different tree. It must have been here the whole time. And oh my God. Well, I guess it can spawn under that tree or this tree because I'm like 90% sure it can spawn under this tree facing over that way. So, okay, that's where that one was. All right, so that is all the different spawn locations for the flowers. Now we just got to get them all and get our V2. Jack, how yeah. are you doing on finding the torch for Michael's account? So far, I have forgot that I was doing that. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. Dude, 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 I saw something on the wiki that said the red flower can actually spawn during the day or during the night. It actually did. Look over here, what? guys. There's another red flower. Over here, over here. Okay, so myth confirmed the red flower can actually spawn during the night. Now, okay, so I have all three flowers. Yeah, I can actually go turn these into the alchemist. All right, so now that I have all three flowers, I can come over to him. <laughs> Do we? <laughs> no. I can talk to him. And then now, for 500,000 plus the three flowers I found, I, he's enhanced my melee attacks. They will now heal me by 25% of their damage dealt, 5% on NPCs. I have lifesteal. Oh no! my gosh. Okay, so that is V2 right there. Now, we can get V3. <laughs> okay, so now to get V3, we need to come here to this secret spot, which is Arrow's Cave, which by the way is right here underneath uh, the diamond flower field guy where you fight that boss. You come down here. We talk to Arrow. Greetings, uh -huh. sir. Come back when you're prepared. I am prepared. I am <laughs> Stop. All right, let's go back. Let's now begin. am I ready, buddy? What? Let's begin. There we go. Okay. Yada, 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 things I don't care about. We need to defeat five players is the challenge for V3 Ghoul. Okay, so. Like people? Yes, and it can be anybody, Kenny, even us. <laughs> no, no, I think that'd be too cheap. We need to go, we need to go hunt yeah. some people. <laughs> Hold him still. Hold him still. Hold him still. Ah! Ah! There's one. There's one. There's somebody here. I heard ice. Down there, down there, someone with ice fruit. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Ah! <laughs> Whoa, what? My God. What the hell? Oh, God. What was that? Hang on, hang on, right here. I got him. Oh! <laughs> fruit detected oh. 50 meters away. Uh, don't mind if I do. Literally, it spawned on top of me. Oh, it's a light fruit. Over there. Over there. You see that guy over there? Go get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. This is safe zone. Oh, uh, no. Oh, it's a light fruit. Get out. Come here. 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 Come we get slightly increased regen, 30% extra run speed during the night. Version 2, we get Life Leech, which means each time we hit a player, we get 25% heal of the damage done, or 5% oh. against NPCs. And now that we have version 3, we have a Heightened Senses, which while activated, this ability will give us, one, the ability to use skills that are still on 40% cooldown. Oh my god, I'm so fast right now. So you can still use skills that are on 40% cooldown and buffs the player's overall damage by 10%, speed by 10% and defense by 15%. We yeah. did it! Max level ghoul! Yay. We are the ultimate ghouls!